Imagine this. You go away on vacation to relax and unwind. Let's say you go to Fiji, for example. You go, you have a great time, and it's time to head home. Only when you get to the airport, the staff inform you that the country from which you hold a passport for does not and has not ever existed. Wait till you hear this. Sounds like something straight out of an episode of The Twilight Zone, we know, but this actually happened. In the summer of 1954, a tourist from Europe checked in at Tokyo Airport to head back to a country called Taurid. He had an official passport, he had money from various countries, including France, of which he had an accent. The Japanese officials scrambled to come up with an answer as to why they did not know of this place. Perhaps they thought it was simply a small country they were not familiar with. The traveler became restless after a while of being told that his country is not a real place on Earth and asked to be shown on a map. He showed where Torrid should be on the map and said that his home was also home to many people between France and Spain and could not simply vanish or be unknown. His situation escalated to a point that he was put under house arrest at a nearby hotel from which he escaped and was never seen again. Is it possible that this guy somehow passed accidentally through a parallel dimension? Similar happenings to the Torrid mystery have occurred before. In 1851, a man wandering about Frankfurt and de Oder in Germany claimed he was from a country called Laxaria, a state found on the continent of Sacria. Another man who spoke a completely unrecognizable language was caught stealing bread in Paris in 1905. He said he was from Lisbia, and although the man did not speak Portuguese nor recognize Portugal as his homeland on a map, the authorities assume he meant Lisbon, the capital of Portugal. And of course, there was the very famous incident from Times Square in New York City, when Rudolf Fenz disappeared in 1876 and showed up in the same point on the Earth from which he vanished in Times Square in 1950. It's crazy. Is it possible that somehow this is happening even today? People who go missing or are reported missing could they be going through space and time somehow into other dimensions? The Man from Taurid is a standout case among these sorts of stories because this is actually backed up with eyewitness accounts of passports and other documentation. Perhaps he was transported back to where he had come thinking it was all just a bad dream. What do you guys make of this incident? Time travel? Atlantis? Are there alternate realities to our own that are similar but with slight tweaks that have massive effects or perhaps we are in a matrix. What's going on? Comments below and as always, thank you for watching.